My boy Yujiro, sorry, I can't say boy anymore. He has now become a man, gone in there unprotected, raw. I hope he didn't get no viruses, but he's gonna be an integrity knight. The whole synthesis ritual was shown, and you saw, you know, Tisei and you know other characters as close to Yujiro being barricaded off. As you see the purple prism, you know, imagery, boom, 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 and now. I guess he's integrity. In, sorry, I guess he's an integrity knight. Synthesis 32. It's gonna be Yujiro Synthesis 32, I guess. Not sure what's going on with Berkeley still, but remember that we still have Fanatio. We have Dusselvolt and maybe even Eldry. Like, there's other knights that are potentially gonna back us up. Kirito and Alice right now, they made a stupid promise of saying, let's go to Ruler Village before we take out like Quinella or some shit. I forget the exact promise we made. And I think that's pretty much where we left off. Let's begin today's reaction. Arisu. Right, her eye blew up too because she broke it. You heavy ass. Heavy fat ass. Yeah, we just dragged you up here. Chained her up and dragged. Chained her up like episode one. So I was. 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 Sorry, Alice. Yeah, no, this is say this is where we say this is your own sweat. Fuck you. <laughs> what are these slice of life moments, man? Synthesis. No, UGO. She looks like a pirate now. <laughs> Quinella's bed. Berkeley. Knight's Commander. Ojisama. And he beat him too! Yujiro. System call. Generate Umbra element. Dark element. Adohia possession. WLSS Nanamar Sashi. Nanyo Ste. He got that? He's just tracking the fucking sword or Yujiro by his code? Okay. Cool. These are his powers from ALO. Sprigan ability, bro. Sprigan ability. <laughs> Dark elephant. I, I don't know. Okay. The sword is behind or below us, but... Yeah, is the eye healed? No organ reproduction? Like for Yujiro? Right, because you need the sun. I, I wonder how... Is that just like a weird superstition? Because they're like, yeah, the solace, you know, the sun, you need the sun, the daytime for sacred arts and nighttime. It's probably better for dark arts or some bullshit. I, I bet there's no difference. Try it. Yeah, just try it. System call generate right eyeball insert. Okay. Kind of kinky. Alright. That is interesting how he used Umbra element there during the night time, right? And the healing usually is Luminous element, and Luminous is more closely related to Solus, and Umbra is probably related to, you know, Vex or some shit. I, don't, I just want to know, like, how true is this fucking lore of. Daytime, good for sacred arts. Anyways, let's go. Oh yeah, this is the uh, aftermath of Yujiro versus Berkeley. And the ice is still present. Yeah, release recollection. How stupid is the fucking... Really, you left him here. You petrified him. You didn't even take him? The Senate just left Berkeley. It's better for us. Right? It's better for us, but like, damn. How stupid are they? Until, unless he's actually dead. If this is a corpse, then I guess it doesn't matter. I thought he's just like kind of like in this stasis position, frozen. Yeah, it's the Senate. We saw that. Deep freeze. Is there a deepest freeze then? Do we have a deep unthaw? I don't know. Yeah. Yeah. Berkeley was getting woke. That's the propaganda speaking. 
more reasons for Alice to like turn against the church, right? Because like so far the whole progression has been her being like kind of hesitant. But Kirito is like whispering nice things into her ear. And she's realizing how like corrupt the church is. And now with this shit, he's going to be anti-Senate as well. And now we don't even need to change her back. Straight up. We can just keep this Alice. Fuck the old Alice, bro. Ign ignore that one. Fuck it. Who cares? Let's just keep this Alice. Is he about to crack and the stone outer side will come off? Or did Alice just kill Oji-sama? Will the flesh be underneath or is he just gonna sn- Oh shit! He's talking? This motherfucker. <laughs> he's still risen. This motherfucker, he's on his one step into hell and he's still risen. He could never do it, but Alice did, huh? Well, well, actually, there is that move that you did where you cut space time. Like, I would like to learn that move. Don't you dare abandon Alice! Take a responsibility as a knight's commander! Don't you dare bail out and say you can do it! No, Oji-sama! Yup, into her bed. Yuji's already been scammed, man. He got gaslit to infinity. Is that Blue Rose? What is that? Oh, it is! The scabbard, too! And now Kirito can dual wield? I don't know. Ow! What the fuck? So unnecessary, A1 pictures. Fuck you. Alright, dual wielding. Anyone done this before? Only a person crazy enough to wield two swords would be a pretentious high-ranking nobleman. Sounds like someone's maybe done that before, but hey, here we go. For the first time in Season 3, we're fucking dual wielding. Not in battle, but we are dual wielding right now. Give me your sword, Santoryu. I wonder why it suits him. Why not? Why? It's just game mechanics? I still want to see where he just like does like system like uh, call uh, enhanced armament for both swords, bro. And as well as like the release recollection. To imagine if he can, you know, use both blue rose and the Giga Cedar tree. But that's just like my fanfic right now, right? Just to have like dual wielding Bankai's both go off. <laughs> How does she manipulate? Okay. Well, it's like Dragon Ball Z style, right? You're on our side. Yeah. That fucking clown. Yeah, what about him now? What about Berkeley? Is he dead? Okay, no, Berkeley's not dead. Okay, good, 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 good. He, he just basically stuck here. He's just gonna be chilling here until, until we, guess we figure some shit out. If we kill the Senate, maybe this goes away, yeah. Yeah, is there multiple Senators? Intentionally keeping them in the dark. Very secret. Nothing. So like the bald head that shows up, remember whenever someone defies something and then it's a portal opens and it's just like, mmm, tracking, I gotcha, motherfucker. Sounds like, you know, the senators are behind that as well. Got it. The knights really are just like completely out of everything and they're just weapons, they're tools, and then the senators and pontifex, they're all scheming and sending them off to do shit. Sounds like it. 
よくそんな高い That's a very good question. Someone as just paranoid as Pontifex would allow those people in those positions simply because she knows that they can't oppose her no matter what? That's a very good question. Why would Pontifex even allow such authority to these senators? Maybe she had to. Maybe she's being threatened? I don't know. That's a very quick question, though. <laughs> Very modern. Whoa. Whoa. This feels like. Remember in ALO? In the game, everything looks medieval and shit. But like, once we got into that room, the, 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 the classified section, right, with all the different experimentation, it got all like modern cyber, you know, like all, all scientific and shit. This, this looks like that right now. <laughs> Creepy noises. It's that- oh! oh! It's the thing again! It's the thing that comes out and snitches! What is it? What are they all doing right now? It came out and snitched? Yeah! Did Alice not break a rule? Surprised that it didn't show up for Alice when her eye burst. What was the events that led her to our eyes bursting? Because we confronted her of her memories and she kind of like declared like her hostility towards Pontifex in the church. And her eye did end up blowing, but the head never showed up and snitched. Right? That, that is what happened, right? They're snitching! Intruder alert. Is it meal time? That's meal time. They all eat food like that? What the fuck is going on right now, dude? It's lunchtime for them. They all need their food, huh? So like, what are these beings? Are they also AI NPCs? I guess so. Are they all created by Pontifex? Maybe just some kind of like homunculi or some shit. I don't know, bro. Mmm, yummy. Rebelling Index? Oh, these are all the senators. I thought that these were like the foot soldiers of the senators going out to snitch shit. But the question still remains intact of like, yes, obviously, uh, Administrator Pontifex is going to be fine with the random bunch of these dudes, you know, in capsules being fed like slaves, right? Of course, we don't have to worry about them. But the main senator chud guy it is kind of crazy how he has those privileges got it it's coming the clown's coming what the fuck are these toys what's he doing what is he mad this is literally the room of a fucking child, bro. Like, in Beyblade Metal Fusion right now, this looks like Utendo's room when Doji bought him all the fucking toys, bro. That's like a nine-year-old kid or some shit. <laughs> Say what you will about him. He is pretty funny, right? Anytime there's like a cloud, it's, 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 for, it's all for fucking entertainment. Okay, what did he see here? That's Pontifex. Did he just see Yu-Gi-Oh and Pontifex fuck? Because he's looking at the orb right now, right? And Pontifex is there. Did, did he literally see last episode with us, bro? <laughs> <laughs> hey, careful. He can turn you into stone. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> Yu-Gi-Oh was there. Good, <laughs> good. <laughs> I'm Alice. Oh, discards that. <laughs> He actually corrected himself there. Sanju, I, I mean, Lady Alice. How respectful. Nah, bro. Cap, cap. 
Yes. Thank you. Like, you're literally helping us. Like, like the mask is off right now. Thank you for letting us know for our cause is even more righteous now. There's so many bizarre things happening right now. First things first, there's a child crying. Whenever a child's crying, I'm usually probably gonna laugh at them. Second, the epic music playing. Third, the fucking voice acting from the senator in the girl voice. What a bizarre scene. <laughs> Sorry, the voice acting is too good. The voice acting is too big right now. Ew, all night? Ew. Oh, went to the festival. This is so fucking creepy, dude. Like, he's being creepy with the... I, he just looks creepy. He hasn't done anything yet, but, like, the whole dialogue and his, the look on his face. Ugh. Dude, A1 Pictures! Yo, again! Like, A1 Pictures does not fuck around with these tongue flicks. Like, like even in the episode 10 with Ryos and Humbert, bro, like, the animation budget spiked up. Every time their tongues were flickering like fucking venomous snakes, bro, it, preying on their girls. Like, they... <laughs> Quickly! A sexual assault scene is about to happen. We need to increase the budget. A1 Pictures Studio Animators, you got it, boss. You did. Very odd. Very weird. What is that, though? Forced. So, like, the synthesis ritual never happened in the beginning? And then... Because, like, Yu-Gi-Oh! I'm assuming that was for synthesis. But, like, for whatever reason, she never went through the synthesis properly? And now they forced it upon her? Right. It was like system call, remove protection, no condom, right? And then Yujiro fell for it, but Alice is like, no, fuck that shit. Pause the automated sentence. Interesting. You can pause everyone. I wonder what happens during that pause. People could just break the taboo index at that time when everyone is paused. That's an interesting mechanic, right? The senators are always looking and monitoring, but they can be paused for this one thing. And during that gap, I wonder if you could do something. <laughs> He's stalling right now. He's stalling, Kirito, you know it. He's buying time right now. Uh-oh. Oh, he's loving it. <laughs> oh! Skewer this asshole. But I feel like he's gonna smile here. And like, it's not gonna matter. I refuse to believe Chudokin will go down this easily. As much as I want him to die right now, I feel like he's gonna smirk and something else is gonna happen. Man, you watching a fucking anime, you just know what's gonna happen if they zoom in on a face like this in a crucial moment. Like, come on. Come on, no one saw this coming? Come on, bro. This is the most cliche shit that could happen. It's just like, ooh, I wonder what's gonna happen with this face. Oh. What, what is this? A clown show? He got away! What? Uh oh. Watch out, watch out. Yeah, generate luminous elements. I don't know. Is that an elevator? Kind of? <sighs> that's Yuji, oh bro. That's blue. That's... He doesn't have a sword, though. The blue rose sword. We still have... Maybe he'll use the fucking force pull or something and take the sword back, but fuck me, dude. <gasps> Look at that new drip, bro. Look at that drip! No! My best friend! How could you? Yuji, you're too fast. 
YouTube doesn't last very long. Yeah, Alice, you don't have to fucking say it. Alice, come on. Come on, what do you mean that's too quick? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he's a quick you shot. <laughs> Your partner. <laughs> you don't last long in bed at all. No! He was too easy to manipulate. True. Yep. And shouldn't this be even easier? Because like we know Yujiro. We know everything about his past memories. Even Alice is here right now. If we think like uh, 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 Eldre folded so quickly, right? You've confronted and integrated about their memories, and it's just like holy shit. And then they break down. So like this shouldn't be that hard. But at the same time, you can't just like meta game your way out of this fight. Like Yuji versus Kirito Alice, this should be a hype fight. So I don't think it's gonna be that simple. <laughs> Thirty-two synthesis. That armor. Yuji. No. Oh. Immediately confronting. Returning my sword. Oh shit! Berkeley could do it, right? Berkeley did the same shit too. Oh no! Damn! Incarnate is that the intention that uh in episode one remember when uh the crimson knight at that time who was not the crimson knights ducival went like and then like, the force power this is like you're moving objects this time you're pulling the sword that what is, what is this right what is it called it's neither there's no name for it it's a secret art Spoken of by Integronite since ancient times. Hmm. Can you do it to Alice? No? We saw Berkeley use it. We saw Ducevolt use it. Incarnate arms? Okay, incarnate arms. What? It's not a ritual that a newly created knight like Yuju could have mastered, yet he has it already. I mean, they, uh, Prime Center was talking about how, like, Yuju had more potential than Berkeley at that point, but I don't know. He can use incarnate arms immediately. Yeah, you should. Simping! What does she give you? Lies! Yes! Because you ate sandwich with her. Without me! And I saw that in the flashlight. So I flashed back. And the whole reasoning is the love is shared with other people, but only I, Pontifex, can give you that monopolized love. That's the thing he folded to, right? Here we go. Not like this, Yujiro. What would TC say if she saw this? True? True? Well, this will be interesting now. Because Integrity Knight's weakness was the lack of combo attacks. For whatever reason, they can't use it. But the Dark, dark Knights can. Again, maybe there's you know actual players there, but... Yuju will now be able to still have combo attacks? Let's go. Wait. Are we not forgetting something important right now? Prime Senator went in a system call generate luminous element, then he disappeared. I don't think he used it to escape upwards because he that would have been aerial element burst and go up. He said the luminous element and disappeared. Uh, I wonder if he's like invisible right now using some sort of light spectrum rainbow shit. I don't know. He said luminous element and he's not here anymore. So like keep that in mind too. <laughs> what the fuck dude? The sound effects here at the last clash. But that's today's episode of SAO. And you know, it sucks that our Aibo, our partner is a synthesis knight, but the pussy was that good, bro. The old hag Gucci was that good that Yuji abandoned us, bro. Well, I hope that, like, Pontifex gets what she's coming. This fucking sucks. And, like, Yuji also has durability really low right now, I think, because I don't know exactly how much of the release recollection he used against Berkeley, but remember, like, his durability probably dropped by a significant amount as well. And this fight, like, we're probably gonna win. Hopefully, we use dual attack. Kirito said that it's uh, not really feasible to use dual attack right now. 
dual wielding. Probably because the object authority level doesn't isn't enough to like use both Blue Rose and Giga Cedar Street. But next episode's looking like a pretty hype fight. And remember, Prime Cardinal, sorry, Prime Senator, that Chud guy, he could still be among us. And that's it from me. If you're still here though, and if you enjoyed this reaction, please like the video. Check out the other playlists for more content. And until next time, take care.